Hey, Scorpio. So it looks like there could be for some, some ghosting going on for one. There could be a situation where it looks like someone's gotten themselves in a pickle. They made a deal with the devil and it looks like they've gotten away with it, but I don't feel like that's gonna last very long. I feel like this person's been tiptoeing around an issue for a long time, but I feel like it's about to catch up with them and I feel like they're trying to escape something. It's like getting trapped, but they already had plan B worked out, um, an escape route in case something happened. Okay, Scorpio. So someone could have wanted I feel like there's some type of attraction going on. A new phase, a new beginning, um, a lot of passion. Scorpio. So something... So the Queen of Cups just came out. So I definitely feel like... So there could have been a separation and then someone kind of toying with someone, keeping them stuck, really not communicating, not being honest, not making a final decision. And it's like, I feel like something got burnt to the ground. I feel like a bridge was either burnt or it's about to be burnt for good, you know? It's like you wanted a war, so you got it. Um, Scorpio. See, I'm telling you, this person has gotten away with something. Definitely. For some of you, you could be dealing with a Libra Taurus. Could be a mother. Mother-daughter. There could be a money situation, a money loss. It could just be uh, estranged family something like that. Um, there could just be no communication with these people. Um, but I definitely feel like someone made a deal with the devil, maybe to start fresh for a clean slate, to wipe something clear. Um, Scorpio. See, I'm telling you, Someone has gotten away with something. I actually think it should be like that. And I think you know what this person's done. It's like, I'm telling you, someone's going to fall on their own sword. It's because whatever has happened, they've gotten away with it. And so they don't really think about it. You know, it's not really on their mind. This, for some, this could be a drug situation. Someone could have stolen money. They could have... So, for some of you, you could know someone who has went to jail for theft. There could be a parent situation that gets really stressed out about possibly trying to get someone out or just, you know, it's just a lot of stress. Um, money situation... Okay, Scorpio. So, you could have someone who wants to invest. They want you to invest in them. Some of you could be dealing with an Aries. There could be a situation where there's no closure. It's like trying to heal from something, but needing more clarity. I feel like a lot of secrets are going to come out because this person... Whatever has happened, it's like this person is very careless. They're like one of those dumb robbers that accidentally dropped their wallet at the crime scene, you know, with their ID in it. It's this type of person who you're dealing with. So, and it can be whatever situation. It doesn't have to be a robbery. I'm just saying, you know, a cheater, they get caught. They, I don't know. Um, okay, Scorpio. 
But I'm seeing like there could be some sex and you could be talking to someone online for some, getting to know someone. Some information may come out about someone. See, so I'm getting that this person. So if you're talking to someone online for some, this person could just want a night of passion and that is it. And as soon as that's over, I mean, I'm telling you, as soon as that's over, they're gone. They're out the door. So be careful with that. Don't, um, okay, I just heard like another notch on the belt. So you don't want to be that. Okay, Scorpio. So I'm also getting a feeling someone could have lost some parents or a child or something like that, um, Scorpio. So for some of you, it could be a family situation. It could be a family reunion, a family gathering. See, okay, someone could have lost their life to drugs, an addiction of some sort. Now that's not for all, but I am really getting that. <sighs> mm. So there could be, okay. So if, if there is some type of loss, there could be a family gathering, a, you know, and a, a fight might break out for some reason. Some, someone just does something really stupid. There's pictures, there's, I, I don't know, it's really weird. Um, Scorpio, whoa, well, okay. So see, okay, so if this is someone that, see I'm telling you, there may be a family function of some sort. You don't really get along with these people, but something might happen and you might have to go to some type of family gathering, you know, and it, it could just be very stressful. It could cause just, you know, people just get on your damn nerves. See? Someone who's just a bully, over dramatic. This Queen of Wands here, just ugh, chaotic drama. Um, just feeling stuck and trapped. Maybe like having to pretend, you know, put on a mask while you're around these people just to get along. Whatever this is, um, just long enough to get whatever you need to get done, and then you're out. Okay, Scorpio. There could be like a lot of very sensitive emotions going on. I keep getting this. I hope no one has lost anyone. If you have, I'm deeply sorry, but I keep getting this Ten of Swords. I mean, mm. see, especially with the judgment. I just really feel... So for some of you, this could be a Capricorn. It could, see, and there's the devil on the back. Could be a Capricorn cancer you're dealing with. Um, mm. Now it doesn't have to be that. Um, Scorpio. See, I can't get away from this Ten of Swords. So something could shockingly happen. But I get a sense of something about just having integrity doing what's right, doing the right thing. Um, you know, there could be some type of invitation to something. It could be a father for some. Um, hmm. Scorpio. But I think whatever this is, it just brings in... Now, for some of you, if this is talking about a love relationship, you, you honestly could just be dealing with someone who's already in a relationship. They're already committed. You could just be the side piece, side chick, or they could have one, you know? I mean, it could go either way on that. An ex may suddenly want to return. Hmm. 
so they could communicate with you. You know, the third party could try to call, communicate with whoever. There's a lot going on. Um, I, I don't know what I'm getting a feeling of like, I miss you. I wish things could have been different. Something. So for some of you, there could be something to do with a mother. Um, Scorpio. Mm. Oh, that is too many, but I guess I'll take them. Um, so there could just be... I swear, I don't know why I'm getting a burial, a funeral, saving money, um, a mother. It doesn't have to be a mother, but you know, there could be a, so, I mean, it could be a husband, it could be a father, it could be just an Aries. It could just be somebody who's very controlling and it's like they're, they're, overbearing um you know they could constantly put someone down constantly shun someone like degrade them make them feel unworthy <sighs> okay scorpio you know someone could be offering that they're going to help they're going to raise money they're going to do something for something and then they lie, they sneak out of it. They, they're actually not willing to do anything. Someone could just be very defensive about, see, I'm telling you, for some of you, there could be a mother, Libra Taurus, it can be whoever, saying that they're gonna give money, that they're gonna help do something, but I'm telling you, they're not. They're not going to. they're not going to at all. Okay. Scorpio. Oh. So you have the Queen of Wands reversed and the Knight of Wands. Hit it and quit it, possibly. I feel like it's some type of unrequited love situation. Um, Someone could be running a lot of relationships. They, ugh, someone could be trying to pay someone for sex. You know, listen, you know as well as I do, this crazy stuff happens, so. Someone could just be completely rejected. Someone may not be attracted to someone. I'm telling you, someone could already be in a relationship. They're not attracted to whoever they're with, and so they step out with someone else. I mean, that's exactly what that looks like to me. And you have the lovers reversed. You see, I just feel like someone's juggling a couple of relationships. Um, mm. Okay, I know that's a lot. Um, all right, Scorpio. So, someone could honestly, oh my gosh, someone, okay, you could be into tarot, into, you know, trying to listen to your intuition, your higher self. You could have someone around you telling you that, oh, you're just into witchcraft, that you do some type of spell work, just some craziness. Um... For some of you, I'm also getting like gender identity. Someone could be kind of hiding that. They might feel like they would be exiled possibly from their family. Um, Scorpio. See, I, this is what I feel like. 
for, for that situation. Now, I know this is definitely not for everyone, but someone's soul could be, it's like covered up. How they feel on the inside of their soul, how their soul is, you know, speaking to them may not be what their appearance is. So like gender identity, you know, someone may be struggling with that. So they may keep something hidden because, you know, how people will judge them. Now, there could be also someone who is haunted by something. They could be seeing spirits, ghosts. Um, I'm telling you, someone's like cloaking who they really are. Okay, one more, Scorpio. Mm. So you do have the trickery. Scorpio. So I just feel like there's a lot of deception going on. Someone could spend a lot of time alone. Oh, listen. Someone could honestly be struggling with something. They could spend a lot of time alone. They could be very depressed. They could be thinking about you know, I, I hate to say it, but suicide, that's for some, because I know someone, you know, I can see that someone is struggling with that. It's like when you're not able to be yourself, you, you know, your family could judge you. Um, so anyway, Scorpio, um, that is what I have for you, and I will see you in the next one.